Happy beautiful day everyone. This is Jen with the Best Life Creation Society here to give you a little glimpse of some of the wonderful things that happened inside of Best Life today. So in addition to a wonderful meditation and our daily leveraging, these happen every day, we had uh, two spectacular business classes uh, really focused around the aspect of appreciation. And um, I'm really feeling the flow of that today. So um, I'm going to read an excerpt on that. Um, also, we had releasing and uplifting. Uh, Dave and Janeta did a wonderful Facebook Live featuring this topic as well. Um, so, and the reason we put so much focus on this today, and I would encourage you to have focus on this every day, um, I mean, is because appreciation can change every aspect of your life. And I'm gonna read an uh, excerpt on this from this wonderful book, Money and the Law of Attraction by Esther and Jerry Hicks. Um, and I'm just gonna pick uh, a couple parts out of here just to expand on what appreciation uh, really is. So, and um, this is coming from the voice of Abraham. Uh, who is a collective consciousness. It's really, in essence, the voice of God or source um, coming through. So, and here's their message. Um, they say the vibration of true love, that feeling of being in love, that feeling that you have sometimes when you see someone and you feel like you are moving through one another, the feeling that you have when you are looking in, looking at the innocence of a child and feeling the beauty and power of that child. Love and appreciation are identical vibrations. Hmm, there's more. Appreciation is the vibration of alignment with who you are. It is the absence of resistance. It is the absence of doubt and fear. It is the absence of self-denial or hatred toward others. Appreciation is the absence of everything that feels bad and the presence of everything that feels good. When you focus upon what you want, when you tell the story of how you want your life to be, you will come closer and closer to the vicinity of appreciation. And when you reach it, it will pull you toward all things that you consider to be good in a very powerful way. Appreciation is that tuned in, tapped in, turned on feeling. Appreciation is vibrational alignment with who I have become. The state of appreciation is me in sync with the whole of who I am. Being in the state of appreciation is seeing whatever you are looking at through the eyes of source or God. And when you are in that state of appreciation, you could walk down a crowded street with all kinds of things that a lot of other people would find reason to criticize or worry about. And you would not have access to them because your vibration of appreciation is picking out for you Things of a different vibrational nature. Yeah, really, really, really powerful. There's even more on this um, because it is such a life changing, aligning a vibration to be in. And so, what I would encourage you to do if you aren't doing something like this already, get a notebook and take you know, 10, 15, 20 minutes a day. You can divide it up even uh, depending on uh, what your schedule looks like. You can do it in the morning. You can do it before you, you know, go to bed in the evening, whenever it feels to, good to you or any point during the day. And um, on the top of your page, write something that you appreciate right? It could be a loved one in your life. It could be your spouse or your child or a parent. It could be a friend of yours. It could be your pet. Or you can write uh, something, um, an experience in your life that you really appreciate. Um, maybe, you know, you're going on vacation, you know, and you're appreciating, you know, want to express appreciation towards that. Or, um, you know, maybe you have a, a car that you love or um, any 
anything. Maybe you want to uh, express appreciation for yourself. Ooh, yeah, that's a different concept. Um, and here's why. When we really kind of tap in and tune into that vibration, when we really are um, sincerely expressing our positive flowing feelings, what we put our focus on grows. Remember, our focus grows things. And so when we're looking at another and we're expressing our appreciation for them, it really allows them to become more. And it really puts us in alignment with who we really are, with the God source energy that dwells within us, right? That life force energy that came into our body upon first breath and goes back to non-physical, expands back into non-physical uh, upon our final breath, right? That, that, part of us that is connected to all that is. And um, doing this can create the most magnificent things in your life. But I would encourage you not to do it to create something. Do it because it feels good. Do it because it's who you really are. Do it because it really will bring out the very best in you. And open up parts of you that have yet for you to be discovered.